Hello, I'm Dr. David Hornbrook, the Clinical Director of Education and Technology here at Keating Dental Arts in Irvine, California. You know, one of the most exciting things in dentistry, and certainly here at Keating Dental Arts, is the use of digital scanners to take digital impressions. We find they're more accurate, they're quicker, they're actually more affordable because we don't have to fabricate a model, so that saves you money. And we're having unbelievable results. In fact, we have dozens of dentists every day that sends, send us digital scans. But the question that's often asked is, how easy is it to send it to Keating, or how do I go about that? And so I'm going to show you because it's very easy. Now, although this is a true def scanner from 3M, most of the scanners or internal camera scanners pretty much operate the same way. And you could talk to your local rep or you could call us and we could help you with that. So here's an example. This is Tim. We're actually are going to do a full coverage crown. We're going to do a Bruxer, KDZ Bruxer, which is our monolithic zirconia restoration. And we're going to do tooth number 14. So after we've done all our scans, we took our prep scan, our opposing, our bite. Then we just push prescription. And then we get a, a window that comes up that almost looks like a, a prescription that you fill out by hand. We start with the date. Again, this is touch screen. We push date requested. One of the nice things at Keating Dental Arts is we have five-day turnaround time. In fact, with digital dentistry, we can sometimes even cheat and make that three days in case your patient uh, is having problems with their provisional or going out of town or whatever it is. So today is the 21st. I'm going to say, well, let's get it back to 27. Touch screen. And then laboratories. I just touch laboratories. And this will list all the laboratories that I use. So if you use a different lab for maybe your orthodontics or um, some of your implant dentistry or removable versus your crown and bridge, you can have those different laboratories. Obviously, we would want you to send it to Keating. Here I have two Keatings. One is the Keating Dental Arts if I want models, and sometimes I want models with my implants or my anterior, or I can actually have it model-less. And what we found is really models are just for us to look at and take the crown and push it on and off. It, it, we see the accuracy, whether it's model-less or models, about the same. As I mentioned earlier, we can save about $20 on your bill with the use of modulus. So I'm going to go ahead and choose modulus because it's a single unit. Then we push OK and then our prescription pad comes up. So for, again, this is touch screen, touch to select restoration. At this point, we have the option of doing a bridge, an inlay, a crown, an implant restoration, anything that we could do with a polyvinyl. So this is a crown, a single crown. Now at this point, we could use a default. The nice thing about this default setting Let's say that we like a particular occlusal staining on most of our posteriors, or we like ovate ponics for all our bridges. We could actually set that as a default with detailed information, and then when we do our next case, we could push the use default button and OK, and it would already have all that information in our prescription. It can save us quite a bit of time. But in this particular case, we're not going to use a default, so we're just going to push OK. Select the tooth. This is tooth number 14. OK. Now we're going to select the design. Now on this TrueDef system, either single or splint. And this is important if you have multiple units within a single arch. Some dentists like to splint periodontally treated teeth. Then we know ahead of time with the digital versus individual restorations. But this is going to be a single restoration. Now we choose material. And 3M here listed the different materials that are available typically on the market today. With tooth number 14, we're going to actually use a KDZ Bruxer, which is our monolithic zirconia. So we're going to put all ceramic. The brand, if we were to choose a specific brand, let's say we wanted 3M's Lava, or if we're going to do a lithium disilicate, we could put Emacs or Empress or Zircon. We're going to use the KDZ Bruxer, again, which is Keating's monolithic zirconia. So we're going to push other. If we wanted a certain occlusal clearance or interproximals, we can set all these preferences ahead of time. But we're going to go right down to shade guide. Again, 3M has most of the leading shade guides here. We're going to use the Vita 3D Master. And after we place that, then we push shade. And we actually used 1M2 for this particular case. And then any details, we can just go into notes. So if I wanted a certain occlusal anatomy or occlusal staining, I may put medium brown occlusal staining with white hypocalcifications on the marginal ridges. But we're not going to put that for this particular case. But because we are ordering a Bruxer, and Keating right now has the Bruxer through digital scans 
$20 off, which is a great savings. And so in the notes section, so I get that $20, I'm going to put the code B R U D I G. And basically that's, so you can easily remember, Bruxer, B-R-U, digital D-I-G. And then we just push OK. Now when this is sent to us, again this is digitally, so we'll get it the same day here at Keating. It tells us what the material is going to be. This code will tell us that it's going to be a Bruxer. We have the shade, and then we just go into Sign. At this point it's going to ask us, to make sure that everything is correct, which is, is certainly helpful. Everything is correct as we talked about, so we're going to confirm, and then we have to put in our digital code, which is basically our signature, and then we push send. That's easy. And again, the nice thing about this is that this arrives at Keating, at our laboratory, the same day. Digital impressions is the way of the future. This is the TrueDef system, which I use here at Keating Dental Arts, as well as I use it in my private practice in San Diego. But if you have a TRIO system, a CareStream, a Plan Scan, a CEREC Connect, or an iTero, they're all excellent systems, and we can accept all those files.